Welcome to another Tech Tuesday. Tech Tuesdays are brought to you by NM Delt, a professional learning project from Propel. This Tech Tuesday video is the first installment on Google Spaces. In today's video, we will be reviewing the differences between spaces and chat, how to create a space, and how to use space features like threaded discussions and tasks. So what is the difference between a group chat and a team space? Chat is designed for informal conversations and Spaces is designed to serve as a dedicated workspace to foster collaboration. You can message and share files in both, but Spaces allows you to thread conversations for communicating about specific projects, assign and track tasks, and better organize your communications using features like the pin board. To create a space, navigate to Chat and then click New Chat. In this menu, select Create a Space. Here, you can decide on your space name. We're gonna call this one Tech Tuesday Demo. Spaces also allows you to assign an emoji to your group space. I'm gonna pick a heart, because I love Tech Tuesdays. Then you can pick whether you want your space to be collaborative or mainly for announcements. You can also decide if it's private or public, and you can decide whether or not you wanna allow external members to join. Then click Create to make your space. Now you can add members by clicking Add Members. For this space, I'm gonna add some of my teammates. To send messages to your team, you'll use it just like chat. Type in the bar, click Enter, and it'll send your message. When you use the Reply option below a message, it creates a thread to allow you to organize your conversations. This allows you to create a sub chat within your space for specific projects without flooding the main chat or making it difficult for other members to catch up when they get on later. You can also pin messages to make them easy to find by right clicking the message, selecting the three dots and clicking pin. This will save your message to the pin board. This would be great for things like timesheet reminders or documents that you find your team having to access a lot. These features are what really make Spaces stand out over chat, as they make it easy for your team to communicate about many different but specific projects in the same space without creating a monster wall of chat in the main chat that leaves everybody confused and behind. Another great feature of Spaces is the Tasks list. To view your task, simply navigate to the Tasks tab. In this tab, you can add a space task to track things you need to do for certain projects. For each task, you can create a title and details, you can set a due date, and you can even set a time that you need it done. Then you can assign it to a specific team member so that that team member knows that they are responsible for completing that task. This shared to-do list makes it easy to track projects that are being worked on as a group. In addition to using tasks to define tasks, set deadlines, and assign team members, you can also talk about them. Use the chat box to open up a thread specific to a given task. Just like the thread we viewed in the last piece, this will make a specific conversation for you to talk about this task. How is it going? Do you need help? Is there anything missing or anything that we've overlooked? This is a great way to ensure that everything your team needs to get done, gets done, and everyone has what they need to accomplish their tasks. It also fosters collaboration in brainstorming and problem solving by allowing you to discuss anything that comes up. The best thing about tasks, as always, is marking them complete. When you finish a task and need to mark it as done, simply check it off of your list and it will move to the completed section of your tasks. Then your team can celebrate getting done with something together. Spaces offers several other key integrations. For example, you can share files directly from Drive to your space in an organized way to allow other team members access to your docs, sheets, and slides as needed. Team members can access shared files in the shared tab in your space. They can also pin files so that you can save important files that get used frequently for your pin board so they're easy to find. 
There are also other apps that you can integrate into your chat. Google has an increasing number of chat apps that can help communication among your team. There are translation apps, there are brainstorming apps, there are calendar apps. All of these can help make your team communication more efficient and more effective. So check out Spaces today and see what apps and integrations and features can most enhance the way your team uses Google.